Hey everyone, today we're gonna do a different video. Um, I have my friends Konsti and Borak here and we're going to each pick three watches with a budget of 10,000 euros. You can decide in the comments which of these three collections is your favorite and we're gonna start right off. What do we win? What, what, what do we win? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. We, <laughs> the winner takes it on. I have an idea. Whoever wins, it's a free watch strap. Yes. So if I win, I get nothing. But if, if one of you one. guys, <laughs> if, if, if you amazing. guys win, you get the, the winner gets a free watch strap, and um, I think that's fair. Yeah. Okay. And sure. the, the loser has to take the next video on pink clothes. Maybe. <laughs> I'll Maybe. find something. Okay. So first of all, if I have a collection of three watches, then I need a watch that is definitely versatile that I could take on for a vacation that is also water resistant and I don't have to worry about it when I'm on the go. So I would go for a Seiko 5 GMT, which is basically around 400, 500 euros, which is, in my opinion, the perfect watch for on the go, for traveling, for swimming. And yeah, nice one. Good pick. Good pick. Right? Konsti, what would you pick? Um, actually similar. So um, I would like to have one Bida. For me, it's um, Psycho Turtle. But the King Turtle, so which, say, uh, which has a ceramic bezel, a sapphire crystal. So it's one tier higher up. One tier higher yeah. up. A little more pricey, but I think um, used market or um, like um, gray market, you can pick them up for 550, 600 euros. Pretty good watch, I think. Okay. For a 36 movement, day-day complications, 200 meters water resistance. And yeah, the everyday beta. Okay. I did not expect that, but, <laughs> but sort of I it. did not know. <laughs> but I'll, I'll do a different one. I have an idea. Um, the watch that I would pick goes into a similar direction. Okay. Um, it would also be a watch that I could wear on an everyday basis, has a water resistance, easy to travel with, and I can change the straps. I take the Nomos Club Campus. Nice, nice one. one. Nice yeah. one. Yeah. And depending on whatever color you want, I'd go for the cream coral because that's the one I have. That's a very cool piece. That's well, pretty cool. Okay. Okay. So, uh, what's the cost of that? I don't know. I think it's around 1,000. 1,300. One. Yeah, something Probably. like that. Yeah. Okay. So you have 500, around 500, 500 and yeah. then 1,300. Okay, so I, I doubled the budget. Okay. <laughs> Almost tripled. Oh, <laughs> the limit is 10K for 10K, all of you. Yeah. Right? Okay, okay. So for the second watch, I would go for a dress watch for special occasions, preferably with a hand wound movement. So I would go for the Cartier Santos Dumont, which is around 6,000 euros, yeah. I guess, something around that. I'm excited for the last pick. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm at, I'm at six and a half right now. I think I'm going to be the boring guy right now because I do like chronographs. I do like manual windable chronograph movements. The obvious choice, um, Omega Speedmaster. Ooh. Plexi is sexy, so of course with Hazelite Crystal. Can't get better than that. You've Probably, got the beautiful yeah. bracelet at 7K, I think, prox in Europe right now. So um, yeah, we'll limit my budget for the last pick, but I think it's a good watch to go and combines pretty well with the Seiko Turtle, I guess. Probably the most iconic chronograph out there. Probably. Doesn't get better, right? Yeah. <laughs> and you could pick a new one, a vintage one. Yeah, whatever floats your board, actually. Yeah. yeah. So it depends on what budget you have. Are you going to pick the new one? The yeah. current one? I, I pick the current um, has a light okay. crystal version. So I think 8,000? 7K. 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 Okay. The so Sapphire that... Sandwich is, I think, 8. Okay. And this okay. one should be... Well, the price increases are right yeah. now like crazy, but I think it's 7K. Okay. Again, I'm going to do something very similar to what Consti just said. Um, I'm going to pick the Tag Heuer Carrera Skipper. Oh, yeah. Chronograph. Nice colors, you're gonna see that in my collection. Fun to wear, you yeah. have a nice chrono chronograph. I love chronographs. Changing straps is easy with this one because again, we have 20 millimeter lugs and you have a playful watch paired to the, with a complication paired to the normals. If, if you have it on an orange strap, awesome. it's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Last pick. So you're at six, six and a half. Six and a half. I'm at seven and a half ish. Seven -ish and it should and be seven six. Two. Ish. Yeah, so, so we're, we're close. So we have a little bit of a budget. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> so my last pick, and, and you will like it. Ooh. I think you won't, but you will like yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I, I have a travel watch and I have a dress watch, so uh, I'm missing a dive watch. Basic, simple, slim, elegant dive watch, and I would go for the Black Bay 54. 
Ah, which is around 3.5k, which completes the full 10k. So you have the Tudor Black 54 as your perfect dive watch with perfect proportions. Then you have your Santos Dumont as a dress watch. And then you have your Psycho 5 GMT as a beater. Beautiful pick. I, I do like it just from yeah, my wrist. It's too small, but yeah. um, that's it. It's a great well piece. Done. Well, well done. Well done. Nice. And I think you have some budget left over, right? No, or is it's it about three, three, it's three, three, pretty seven. much. Yeah, I, I think the black base around three and a half. Okay. Okay. So pretty close to 10K. Yeah. And Consti, what's your last pick? Because I, I would like, when I think about perfect three watch collection in this price range, I would like to have a diver crown and a dress watch. My dress watch is going to be the Union Glass Hütte Noramis Date, 2400 euros. Um, Union does um, assemble and build their own movements where they get components from ETA, but they assemble the whole movements um, in Glass Hütte because this is a watchmaking rule. If you produce there, yeah, they've got the silicium spiral, um, which helps with anti magnetism, 100 meter water resistance. They've got beautiful dial colors inspired by yeah. old vintage Porsche Carrera. So you've got yellow, red, blue, but really great colors. And I think, from my opinion, this is a great pick. Not what you can see very often in, in the wild, but I think a very, um, very underestimated brand. A pretty cool, pretty cool piece. Very nice. Yeah. Very nice. So I have a watch in mind, but I think I'm going to be over the budget. Ah, come on. <laughs> And approximately a couple of hundred euros, but well, we'll try it. Okay. The watch I have in mind is also a dress watch, a watch that we already talked about today, and it would be the Cartier uh, Tank Must um, with the black dial, the monochrome nice. oh, version. Yeah, nice um, I think the the price was around three thousand euro when I bought it. Now it's I think at three thousand five hundred. So yeah. three seven even. Wow. Um, <laughs> okay, so I'm a bit way over budget, but. These would be my three picks. Well, I think yeah. used. Yeah, yeah used, used you can get it. Up. Yeah, probably for a two five, something like that. Oh, yeah. That yeah. Good. I had the um, Nomos Cup Campus. Yeah. Uh, the uh, Takoya Carrera Skipper and the Cartier Tank Must. OK, that's a nice collection. And you had? The Seiko 5 GMT, Black Bay 54 and Santos Dumont. Very nice, nice. very nice. I've got the Seiko Turtle, King Turtle, the Sapphire Crystal Ceramic um, Bezel Inlay, the Speedy, and the Noramis, Union Gasset Noramis Date. Wow. Okay. Those are actually three very different collections. <laughs> <laughs> I would suggest that you guys uh, pick your favorite one, and uh, then we will see whoever gets the free strap. Yeah. 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 Let's see. Yeah, put it in the comments down below. Let us know who won or who's, whose collection you would pick and what's your favorite. And uh, thank you guys. Thank Thanks. you for joining. Thank Please do us. check out their channels on YouTube. I will have all the links in the description down below and uh, definitely also check out their Instagram. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for joining Thanks. this video. Thank you. It's great to see you guys. So awesome. see Take you care. soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.